Konnichiwa everybody, my name is Zipster and welcome back to Finding Paradise. We just left off after getting to the rooftop of this place yet again, but this time we're on the other side. Without clear way, pack up over here. So Neil said he has an idea, if I remember correctly. Uh, vents? I would assume vents. No? Let's talk to Rosaline. He's on the other side, right? We could just... Shh! Oh, shiny! Look, Neil, all we need to do is to get over that wall. I don't know what you're planning, but let's try and keep it simple. Don't worry, it doesn't get any simple than this. What? What? What is that? Is that... Hookshot! Come on, give me a break, I've al I always wanted to try this. Yeah, actually, I'm interested, because I always wanted to hookshot something myself, since I've played Ocarina of Time. What a wonderful game, except Water Temple. Fuck Water Temple. Sheesh, ever since then, I've hated water levels in every single game I've played. Alright, I guess it's straightforward enough. Yeah. Um... Emma, what? Full power! Onwards! I can feel it, Eva! What? This hookshot! It's the hookshot that will pierce the heavens! What? <laughs> Good one. Good one, Neil. You made me chuckle. Dude, unshake, Pl unshake Pluto and put it back in orbit right now. Relax, it was copy paste, not cut paste. Not to mention, in part, procedurally generated. Cool, put it back. Now, let me just turn on its localized gra- You'll kill entire planet. Gravity. Wait, what? That- What is wrong with you? What? You said it was alright to use my hookshot. Now let's just turn the gravity off and- well, you do realize that's not something that will happen, right? If you turn gravity of Pluto... I mean, I guess it's a miniaturized Pluto? Even then, you will die! Bye, Pluto! Thanks for the lift! Oh, it looks like a balloon with the hookshot attached to it. It's not even a real pl- Dr. Rosalien? I've started to hate you real uh, hate you now. <laughs> Pluto is a real planet. <laughs> Your face isn't a real planet. That that was your comeback. Back in my day. Okay, I'm not going there. Because I started to feel old. Uh, your face isn't a real planet. At least it was in you. Kill me. End my suffering now. Just take a gun. Ugh. At least it was in your anus. <laughs> mm. What was that? Nothing. Let's get going. I'll just pretend that this interaction never happened. Never. Can we go now? Okay. Huh? Talk about staying up past bedtime. Hmm. Is Faye still there? Yep. Don't even bother. It's not gonna fly over, you know. We're not. We're too far apart. 
is that supposed to symbolize something? So, are you gon ever gonna finish telling me the story? Hmm? The one with the injured bird you found when you were a kid. There's not much to it. You know how it goes. The bird had a broken wing, and I took care of it for a while. The vet took it in afterwards, but... But what? But I tried to steal the bird back. You thought you'd take better care of it? Of course not. I knew I shouldn't have. Then why? Because it was my only friend, I guess. Um. That's kinda hurtful for Faye, I guess. That's not something you should say. Because the bird was my only friend, I guess. You're not an existent person, Faye. You're just my fake. You're just but a figment of my imagination. That's that's rough, God, dude. I just didn't want to let it go. What about Faye? Wow, what a load of sap is such a rain. What the heck is such a rain? I've never heard a single person use that word. Not even once. I might give you a handkerchief for that dog, or even a cat, but a bird? I knew I shouldn't have said anything. Everyone I told that story to either told that, either told or got bored to sleep. Wait, what? Everyone I told that story to either thought. Wait, what? Oh, I'm dumb. Everyone I told that story to either thought that, that or got bored to sleep. Eh, you should put a comma there or something. Be because it's, it seems like this is one long sentence and it's not. It was weird. Yeah, can't help you there. But everyone goes into things with their own context, you know. Maybe it's only fair that they didn't care much for it. Maybe the bird was something different to you than it was to them. Or maybe you just sucked at telling that story. Why not both? I just wanted them to relate. Yeah, how did that work out for you? Well, it didn't. Not every story is meant to be told, you know. True. Some of them are meant to be kept. And some are forever forgotten. So how did it end? I I think the bird flew off. I think I lost it, but it came back to say goodbye one day. You think? I don't know. I kept I kept on mixing up reality with Dai Jin back then. Um Another foreshadow, I guess. Hopefully not, but I think this is another foreshadow. This guy might legitimately have Alzheimer in the future or something related to that. Rough. Hopefully Faye is real. I really hope Faye is real. Did I say that correctly? I, I, I think I said I really hope he's real. Or maybe not. Maybe, maybe I'm just starting die dreaming. Colin, you infected me. I guess I was living in my head a little too much. It won't make it. Oh, we actually did. What a surprise. Huh, you're getting better at this. Nah, it's the wind. If the wind was going from right to left, it wouldn't happen. I used to daydream about taking off on a big paper plane, you know. We'd fly all over the world, seeing all kinds of sights. And I could just fly across from balcony to balcony. Well, that's done. You can't fly on paper, you can't fly on paper planes, silly. No, duh. I mean, if you really want to fly so bad, why don't you go and become a pilot? <laughs> and he did. And he did. Wait, you're serious? Yeah, why not? What do you mean, why not? One doesn't simply just go and become a pilot. I mean, you kind of do. Kind of 
Yeah. It's a profession as any. Go to a college, university that specializes in stuff like that, I guess. Or to military. Air Force is a thing. One doesn't simply just be gone and become a pilot. Why doesn't one? Because how? Well, planes take off from airports, right? It doesn't hurt to find one and ask. That's... Wait, like, ask plane? Or a pilot? If only it could be that simple. If you just let it be, maybe it could. You never know. If you don't, uh, if you don't try, you never know. I should go, Colin. I know. Hey, I'm gonna look for that airport tomorrow. Google Maps, bro. I mean, I guess not different time. I guess they didn't even have smartphones back in the day. Received bleh, note flying. Hmm. Hmm. Well, the friendly girl next door would be one way to get inspired to fly, I guess. I, th I think she was more than just a friendly girl to him. Wow, seems like he ran into a poster sale. Or puberty. Actually, both. What's up, Colin? With a balcony room like this, his parents sure are confident in his sleepwalklessness. Hmm, wait. There's something shiny. Poster of a tropical island surrounded by a lagoon and barrier reef. Hmm, that looks familiar. Does it? It's the same place as the painting hanging above his bed in his elderly days. He's also keeping this exact same picture in the attic even now. For a teenager, he sure had some old-fashioned taste in posters. Hmm. One more. The book. I mean, if you really want to fly so bad, Faye said, why don't you go and become a pilot? Why, why, why would you... Hmm. Why would you write that down? That's kind of creepy. So this green book from the shelf is just a journal? Seems legit. Yep, a mento. Where is the last orb? Locked. Assorted VHS tapes consisting of sci-fi, classics, and horror movies. What is that? I think that's just a trash. Bookshelf, maybe? A Rudolph plush toy sits in the bookcase. Oh, he kept it. Hmm, what's that, maybe? Remember, remembering all these late night conversations all while... Oh wait, that's what that was. Remembering all these late night conversations all while in his dying bed. <sighs> cello? Call his cello. It's kinda cram out here. Let's head inside. Yeah, let's. I'm missing something. The clock? No, maybe the posters. The poster of a horror movie. Really? Huh, didn't think he had in him. Didn't think he had in him. Hmm. Let's go. Now back to his trap. No, th this is his childhood. Hmm. I really wonder what happened to Faye. I mean, most people at this point will wonder what happened to her. She's the main point of the story right now. Hmm. The airplane, right? No. Oh, this right. Hmm. Hmm. How do you... This place has... Oh, I get it. No, that wasn't it. Oh, the book. I'm pretty sure I know how to do it. I think. Wait, 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 wait. No. Not now. No. And we're true. Hmm. Journal. Let's go. Let's see what will happen in the future. Or, well, past future. Oh, cockpit of a plane. 
The journal is in a weird place. I mean, he keeps, he, he helped it actually. That's. I mean, he's this is important. Well, so much for the cliffhanger of whether he became a pirate. I, You have even shorter memory than I do, Dr. Watts. We are, we have already been here. More like cliffhanger. Stop it. You're killing me inside. I mean, I was already dead inside, but you're killing me even more. Yeah, you just, you, you can't respond to that. Oakland Center, Cactus 135, cruising flight level 390. Cactus 135, Oakland Center, altimeter setting 3007, see ya. Altimeter 3007, Cactus 135, out. See, Greenhorn, you gotta play by the rules and use them proper radio words. Every single time. Even when you're not on the radio at home. To your wife. But the chief instructor said. Do I look like the chief instructor? Is her face also endowed with this award winning mustache? Don't think I'll be going easy on you just cause this is your first flight with the company. As my first officer there are only two things I ever want to hear from you. There yes captain and landing gear down. Oh, so this is where he got it, get got that from. That's funny, sir. Do I look funny to you? No, you don't, sir. What did I just say about the only two things I expect to hear from you? Yes, Captain. So I do look funny to you. Uh, landing gear down. <laughs> Son of a gun! They sent me all the brainless pretty ones. Is it a good thing? I'm not sure. This can't be serious. Well, you know how memories get exaggerated sometimes. I hope. Received. Blah. Note. Captain Ernst. Only two, I guess. That's not... That's not a lot. The journal. Is he still keeping journals in this thing? It's just some sort of pref light check... Checklist beyond there. Yes, Captain. I had one request. You must send me a cord. And what do they do? They send me a cord. This is the life of a captain of a ship. Sure. Who's Charlene? Well, how was the first day? Is Captain Ernst always like that? I barely did a thing but sit there. Oh, yeah, you should probably get used to that for a while. Forget about him though, you got any plans for the night? The other flight attendants and I were thinking of taking you out for some drinks to celebrate. Oh, tell them thanks, but I'd better head straight back home. My wife's just about hallway into her first trimester. I'm away for long enough as this. Wow, double congrats, got a name picked yet? Yeah, we're thinking Usher. Is the memento? Obviously it is. And go. Hmm. Wow, that's a lot of hot. Um, I just like this, maybe. That was easy. I really hope. They didn't uh, put secret endings in this game. Like you have to solve these puzzles differently than you do it did. That would be a dick move. Yes, activate it. Hmm. Huh. Huh, he, went, he really went there. I mean, that was to be expected. This place kinda look familiar. Go on! Wait, go on! Ask him! Um, excuse me. Are you an airline pilot? It's a small, it's a small municipal airport kid. You won't find any airlines here. I'm a charter pilot. You looking to, you looking to charter a plane? I'm looking to learn to fly. 
Can you teach me? Looking for an early start, huh? Sounds like you want to talk to the flight school instead. Make a turn up ahead and follow the hall. They'll deal with you at dispatch. At dispatch. See, I told you it's worth a try. True us. I wonder if the same hat. It's likely not. Wait. I guess we cannot talk to him. Can we go outside? Actually, yes, we can. I'm surprised. Is there something here? Hmm, there's a trash can. There's. I cannot. I don't see what this thing is. Post office box? I don't know why they've let us go outside. I have no clue. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing here. Also, my lips are awfully dry. It's annoying. Oh, a vending machine. I want Fanta. Ah, give me a fix, you stupid thing. Why do I never learn? I... I don't know. Beat me. Oh, hello there. Hey, I don't think I've seen you around here before. Yeah, I'm trying to find out how to become a pilot. Oh, that's simple. You get an instructor and you train. I'm actually working my own license. How I done, in fact. Isn't it expensive to train? Yeah, but that's why I'm working here part-time. The pay is not much, but the discounts on the training flight helps. That's smart, actually. Work here for the discounts. A painting of flying single engine plane. I think this painting was I think this I think this painting was hanging at Collins. In Collins attic when I went there an Ariel. Took home a souvenir, I guess. I wonder if he worked here. I really do wonder if he worked at that shop. It's possible. Hello? Nobody's here I can't talk to. I wish you could run in this game. You really walk awfully slowly. I guess. That's to set the mat. What the heck is that? What in the world is that? Just leaving something for the class. Maybe the head should have been smaller for aerodynamics sake. Who cares? It's got extra propulsion coming out of its butt. Hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Look at my face. Look at my face. Is it laughing? I guess it's laughing. I don't even know why I'm angry at this. A post of the control panel of a small aircraft. This looks weird. Uh, really weird. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh, my eyes. I wonder if Colin's parents can afford this. Hopefully they can. Less problems for Colin. There are airplanes outside. I bet this is where they dispatch them. We do offer flight training and you do meet the requirements, but it's costly. Is there any other way at all? Well, that's not up to me to say, but... Why don't you check with the owner? He's on the break right now and I let him know you're coming. The owner of the entire airport? Yep, it's his family owned airport. His office at the other side of the hall. Did you hear that? It's family owned. What does that mean? It means that it's owned by a family, duh. Well, no shit. And also, that is probably a mafia. Mafia? Uh, what mafia? And I'm behind you, you know? Yeah, just like in The Godfather. Let's go visit. What? Careful, you might end at the bottom of the lake. Silly kids. Hmm. You never know. I'm ready to go, sir. I got here early and got the weight and balance calculated and the logbooks all checked. Two words. Low clouds. <laughs> yep, you're cancelled for the day. I don't get it. Does low clouds matter? Let's go inside. <laughs> this is not real. I can't believe this is real. This is not real. He was impressed 
by Faye saying that, that's why the memory looks like this. You've got to be kidding me. So, you're the kid they told me about. <laughs> Look, sir, I don't want any trouble. Of course you don't, son. There's word on, on the street that you want to become a pilot. Yes, sir. But you have no experience. No, sir. No background. No. And you have no money. I don't, sir. Yet you come here. On the day of my own daughter's flight exam. To request my hospitality. To make use of my facility without an offer. Snickers. Fuck off. Do you disres disrespect me and my family's airport? Psst. Tell him you've got strong arms and can help out around the airport. Um, I got reasonably strong arms. Oh. Are you saying you're up for work? Yes, you are. I yeah, I am. Hmm, interesting proposal. It's true, there have been a few positions opening up recently. Perhaps we could use a hand. Very well, your offer is not one I won't refuse. Another amaretto sour, Ricardo, and hold the amaretto. Kid, you work for me now, and with the earnings you shall pay for your training, one flight at a time. Quick, thank you, man, step back. F thank you for your kindness, sir. See? You did it! Wait a minute, all this happened, it's just that I applied for a job. Shh, you're practically the underboss now. Y yeah, it would work that way. So, uh, assuming exaggeration of memories. Is this like racist to Italians? I can't tell. Neither can I. Is it? It's stereotypi stereotypical, maybe, but not necessarily racist. Also, yeah, that. Italian isn't a race, Neil. Yeah, it isn't. But he does have to seem to have tendency for getting creative with his memories. Hey, maybe that's just what he gets for watching that movie when he's eight. Anyhow, let's see if the Don has anything for us. Received bleh, note, first job. An Amaretto Sour drink without the Amaretto. If something is called Amaretto Sour, and if, the, if you don't put Amaretto in it, is it still ca called Amaretto Sour? Because I don't think it is. If you drink cola with lemon, but you don't put lemon in it, can you still say that you drank cola with lemon? I don't think so. It doesn't work that way. Let's go back. I mean... Let's go. In the future? Past? It's weird. It's really convoluted. Let's not deal with that. Let's go. Because the more I think about it, the more my brain wants to kill itself. What is that? Oh yeah, Amaretto without Amaretto. I really do start to hate those puzzles. I really do. Uh, those puzzles can get annoying. Uh, I wish you could skip those puzzles. I really wish. Yeah, we're true. But those puzzles start to get tedious a little bit. Activate Mento? Sure we can. Under where? Hmm. Vacation maybe? Finally, some tropical air. There you go, sir. Your amaretto sour. Hold the amaretto. Oh! <laughs> That's actually quite nice. Thanks, just the way I like it. And for you, lady, your amaretto sour, hold the sour. Hmm. 
Why thank you? I didn't know you guys make this. Are you gonna be able to handle all that lemon juice? It's an old favorite. We're actually here. You've wanted to visit for a long time now, haven't you? Is this everything you dreamed it would be? Well, when you've got the expectations. But yes, it's still beautiful. Now about you though. Hmm. You know, spending half of savings on a delayed honeymoon and all that. Hey, now's not the time to think I like that. We bounce back up. I got quite a few gigs waiting when we got back. Not to mention your new job, Mr. Airline Pilot. Don't jinx it, it might still be a while until I start with the company. Besides, the pay's not gonna be good for a while. Hey, as, as long as you get to wear the cool shades. <laughs> True. I talked with Maria last week, we got the flexible hours arranged. So we're ready, huh? Yeah, as ready as we're gonna be. You know, this might be the last ship like this we'll have in a long time. <sighs> we'll make the little bastard pay for all the vacations we missed one day. In the meantime, all the more reason to enjoy the rest of it. Here's to the rest of it. Yeah, here's... Damn it! Not doing this. But okay, I'll do it. Shit! Damn it! Fuck! Fuck! Smooth, fella. Receive the note. Regret. Sloppy start. Okay. We are out of time for this episode, so I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to leave that like and share this video. You might also subscribe to my channel for more content like this. As for now, I hope... My brain just exploded right now. But yeah, as for now, I wish you farewell. Sayonara!